Ah, mana upp, nu ska ni få se Kong igen. All right, hello guys. This is another... Oh, sorry. This is another... Um, what do you call it? Like, d donation request? Anyways, this is donation request by Epstein is Innocent. Um, he asked me two things. And yes, I did like three to five minutes research into these things. Uh, one of them was about Epstein murder. And the other one was about the new James Bond, which I had no idea about. So, let me start with the new James Bond. I don't care. I have never watched a James Bond movie. I've never played any of the games. And I have no interest in it. So, alright, the new James Bond is a black woman. I don't care. That's just how my opinion on this is. Kind of like, alright, they want to do a black woman. Um, maybe I should have checked out because now when I'm talking about like that, oh yeah, maybe I should have checked out how well did the last James Bond movie do? Did it fall off? Have the merchandise side of the James Bond movie, have it been falling down? And that's why they're kind of like, let's try something completely different. I don't know. Uh, but he thought, do I think it's a bad choice? I don't know. Um, when it comes to James Bond, I don't know anything about the James Bond lore or anything. So there you go. Uh, but one thing about that though is that um, I mean, if they would actually focus on, uh, for example, instead, you could, what I know about James Bond is that he's a womanizer. So if they reverse that and make her, fuck, I mean, probably not because well, let's be honest, the way the new, the way she looks, I couldn't see her being like a manonizer. Fuck, I don't know what is the opposite of a womanizer. I'm, you know, unless they make her homosexual, unless well, unless they make her a lesbian, I guess. Uh, but that would be even further, kind of like, oh god, come on, this is obvious what you're doing. I mean, I don't think it will be successful. It will probably make money, but probably not. It's probably not going to be that. Well, maybe it will. I don't know. Uh, I do know that the, the Ghostbusters and the other things that I've tried doing this gender bent stuff on, it never works. I mean, I think it would be better if they made a completely new IP with a female, with a British female spy. Sure, do that instead of just, uh, like, rule... It is, no, it's rule 63, I think. Anyways, instead of just a gender bent James Bond. So, that's my opinion on the James Bond thing. The Epstein one. Well, I don't think he committed suicide. Alright, let's just put that out there. I do not think he committed suicide. It's kind of like, ah, that's bullshit. That is bullshit. Someone wanted him silenced. I don't think it's Hillary Clinton or Trump, like some people. Well, those two seems to be like the main people people are talking about. And I don't think it's either of them. I think it's probably someone that Epstein hadn't mentioned yet. That is who I think. If anyone would. Well, I don't think it's a single person. I think it's because it's a cabal of people. And it's some people that Epstein didn't talk about yet. So, there we go. I do think that everyone in that prison should be 
under lock and key, they should actually go to jail now. Well, at, at least anyone who is relevant. But the thing is, can you trust the government with this? Of course you can't. So it's kind of like the ones who are going to look into this are probably corrupt. Or probably people are like, you know what? We don't want it to, even though they might not be involved directly with Epstein, with this, uh, with his island and all that. But man, they're like, we cannot expose this because, or we can't even go into it because the people we're going going to go into are connected to us one hundred percent. All of those people there at the top are all connected. So. If they decide, ah, oh, you know what, let's go into it, then it's like, oh god, we are connected to all of this. Everyone here is connected. Let's not do anything. So, that's what I think about the Epstein thing. Uh, yeah, I don't think Hillary or Trump are directly involved in the murder of Epstein. Um... I wouldn't even say that they are indirectly. I would say those two are probably... Well, I would say Trump is probably scot-free. Maybe not Hillary. I don't think she's directly involved. She might be indirectly involved. Maybe. But... That's just a maybe. I don't think so, though. But yeah, that's it. I hope that was <laughs> 25 cents well spent.